So here we have the first look at the Surface One Click CPU Miner. Uh, of course, there are three versions available. There's one for the Mac here, the .dmg version. .exe is for Windows, and a .deb is for Ubuntu Linux. Uh, because I'm on Windows, I'm going to download the Windows version. So I'm just going to click this link here, save. I'll give it a few seconds to download. You may see this message pop up, uh, this file is not commonly downloaded. That's fine, it is a brand new piece of software, so um, it's going to be expected. Uh, given time though, um, this will uh, this message shouldn't appear after a few downloads. Uh, again, the same with this, Windows protected your PC, uh, Windows Defender Smart Screen. This is a new piece of software, um, It's not very, uh, Windows isn't very familiar with it. As you can see, when I clicked on that view more, uh, you'll see that the publishers are SafeX developers. They're using their SafeX developers certification. Uh, the more times that this software is downloaded and installed, uh, the Windows uh, Smart Screen uh, Defender system will realize that this is a normal piece of software. Sometimes this comes up um, due to the minor software, the underlying mining software that's embedded within the software. Sometimes uh, it it, it throws off a few virus scanners, but uh, they've done they've done the best that they can to um, embed it into the software without uh, causing too many issues. But just be aware of that anyway, um, and to be one hundred percent sure, make sure that you're downloading it from the official SafeX um, um, GitHub repository. So sorry if this video seems a bit rushed. The files have literally just dropped about 14 minutes ago, so I'm just I'm keen to get this installed and ready. So there you go, it's all installed on my PC. Now there's two ways that you can run this. If you've already got a pre-generated uh, new SafeX blockchain address, you can simply paste it into here. Um, I'm going to show you how to create your uh, create your own address here, and it's using this button here. So it's new wallet. There's also a question mark here, which if you click on it, it will explain everything that you need to know. I'm going to click New Wallet, and I'm going to click Generate New Wallet. There it will give me the full address, and also the secret spend key and the secret view key. It is absolutely important if you want to import this into the upcoming new wallet, that you have these two files here, uh, these two uh, keys. Otherwise, you will not be able to import it into your new address. So you've got both the public address. This is where you would point in your miner towards. And the secret spend key and the secret view key, which are used to recover your keys if uh, you want to import it into a new wallet or if you've had to, if you want to back it up, for example. I'm just going to copy this address here. Now you have the option to uh, select a number of pools here. Um, I'm going to obviously use my pool here. I'm going to paste the address into there. I'm going to click start. Look at that. How nice is that? Animated and everything. Give it a few seconds. It uh, takes a, a few seconds for the miner to start up. Once the miner's started, you'll see that the hash rate is starting to build up here. At the moment, I'm doing just shy of 100 hashes a second with my CPU. You can scale. Obviously, if you want to change the um, number of uh, threads or the percentage of threads that you want to be using, you're going to have to stop the miner. I'm just going to try show you 50%. Hopefully, this won't lag the video out. Now you have it, the one-click mining app is now available for you to download and run yourself. In the next video, it will be featuring the new SafeX blockchain wallet. Uh, there's a lot of features on there that we're going to go through, but uh, for one of the videos I'll show you how you can import this address into the new wallet so you can view your balance. Um, if you also want to check how, how your mining is doing on the SafeX News Pool, you simply go to pool.safexnews.net. 
worker statistics. Put that in there. And it will give you the statistics for the mining that you've done. Obviously, this is a brand new address. It hasn't been, it's been mining for a few minutes now, so it's not going to have any blocks found or anything like that yet. But uh, I'll leave a link to this page on your pool, and it'll be the same for the other pools if you do decide to use one of these other mining pools. Uh, it's a very similar for, uh, page, uh, worker statistics, that you can use to view the status of your miner, how much you you mined so far, um, your round contribution, for example, your pending balance, how much has been paid, for example. Uh, do note that your current hash rate on the pool versus what your hash rate in the miner, there will be a little bit of a discrepancy. The pool uses um, uh, uses a base of averages based on how many hashes that you've submitted. Um, so obviously it will need a longer period of time for it to get a more accurate recording of your hash rates. So if you're seeing, it's only saying, like for example here, it's only saying 29 hashes a second, whereas in here it's 111. That will be, uh, that will be the case for the short while anyway. So yeah, enjoy it. Uh, get it downloaded, start mining, and uh, let us know how you're getting on.